gosh, you're hitting my hot, you know, the, the hot buttons for me. This, this drug is a gateway drug to a bipolar and schizophrenia diagnosis. People think it is this safe herb that is harmless, and it is simply not. I, as someone who works in deep prescribing, a lot of the patients that come to me, they've had a drug-induced psychosis. They've been misdiagnosed bipolar and schizophrenic, and they've been put on antipsychotic medications. When they stop using the drug, sometimes it takes a year or so. Eventually, the psychosis and mania goes away, and they can come off people. Cannabis is actually neurotoxic. My patients, they're telling me they're still having periods of psychosis. Um, the cannabis that we're using is about 40 times stronger than the ditch weed people used to smoke back in the 70s. And we're pretending like it's That's the right. same thing. You can't differentiate mm -hmm. cannabis from 1975 versus cannabis now, which is 98% THC. These are different. You, you literally cross thresholds where they're literally different molecules in the sense of how they affect the physiology of the human.